girl, she looks rough today. Hello everyone, I'm Colleen, and this is my little cute son. This is Flynn. Look at his hair. You cute little nerd. How did I end up with a red-headed, blue-eyed son? That's the real tea. So I'm not able to get out very much because I have this new little cute baby. So I buy a lot of my stuff online on Amazon, and I buy him a lot of stuff on Amazon, and I have recently found a lot of weird items on Amazon. So I decided to go and find the weirdest, most unusual baby products on Amazon, and we're gonna test them out, huh, buddy? Not even phased, he's so used to me burping all the time. Oh, you're so cute, how am I supposed to do anything when you are so cute? Okay, let's see what's in this box, Flynn. First thing we have that I thought was really weird was a placenta plush, okay? So this is literally... Okay, placenta, baby's first roommate. Literally a stuffed placenta. This was one of the first things that popped up when I looked up weird baby products. So here, it's your first stuffed thing that I bought you. I haven't bought him any like teddy bears or anything. So this is the first one, do you like it? Give it a hug. Oh, he doesn't like the placenta. Some women keep their placenta and like eat it. <laughs> I'm not kidding, that's very common now. People make them into pills, put it in little capsules and like eat it. Um, I didn't do that. No shame to anyone who does. Like a lot of women do it now because I guess it's really good for you. They say there's a lot, a lot of vitamins in your placenta, but I just take vitamins instead of eating my placenta. So that was my decision. But a lot of women do eat it. Placenta is essentially what made you grow into a human. So I thought maybe you missed the placenta you grew with, so I got you this one. It connects to your belly button. Let's see what the next one is. Next thing I found was Tootie the Bear. This is totally up my alley. This is a bear that just farts. So you push it somewhere, maybe squeeze it. What do you think, Fun? It's the same fart every time. Hmm, a little disappointed. I wish this, this bear had multiple fart sounds because no two farts are alike. But here, do you like your Tootie Bear? No, oh, he does not approve. So far, Flynn doesn't really like either one of the things I've bought, so that's really cool. Oh, I also got this outfit, which is literally an outfit that like turns my child into a mop. So when he crawls around and rolls around, he cleans the floor. It looks like it is not from this country, the writing on it. Um, none of it is in English. However, this size is way too big for Flint. So we're gonna have to wait a while to see if this one works because it's massive. But it's definitely, it's like a, like a spongy rat. I don't know if you're supposed to get like soap and water on your kid first or what, but apparently he crawls and scoots around the floor and cleans it. I will give you an update on this later. He's big enough, probably in a couple of months. Next we have diaper changing glove sack. So in case he's got a poopy diaper and you don't want to touch it, which I mean, to be honest, most parents, I feel like you just just kind of like get an immunity to like poop and pee. It doesn't really bother you, but it explodes out of his clothes a lot and it gets on you, it gets on the bed. When you're changing him, sometimes he kicks around and gets it all over himself. And so these, I guess, are so that when you change the diaper, it like wraps around the diaper. So we're gonna have to go try these out. Let's check it out. I don't mind just changing with my bare hands. I don't know who, what parent would ever do this, but we're gonna try it because it was a product I saw. Diaper off. Diaper in a trash bag! Maybe if there was like a super blowout, it would be. No, no one would ever use this. <laughs> no one would ever use, like no parent would ever take the time to put on that glove to do that. It's totally not cool. And you can just do that with regular gloves. You don't need all the extra space, so I think that was silly. Uh. Yeah, let's see what else we got. Oh, this is a teaser that you can record your voice on. So like while he's chewing on it, you can be like, I love you, baby, <laughs> or something creepy and weird. I don't really know why you'd want to do that. I guess you can also put like music on it and stuff. So we're gonna have to try this out. Oh no, what's wrong? You don't like the teaser? Is it nap time? Okay, so I've got this little thingy here. I'm gonna try to record something on it. So hopefully he will like this. I'm going to encourage him that even though his teeth are hurting him, that he can do it. So that's what I'm gonna record on this thing. Oh no, Flynn, do your teeth hurt? You can bite this thing super hard. Get it, get it, Flynn, you get it. Oh no, Flynn, do your teeth hurt? You can bite this thing super hard. Here you go, Flynn. You're doing it, I love you. Is that your voice? Oh my God. Super hard, get it. Get it Okay, this one's good, but I don't, I'm gonna take off my own recording because I just think it's weird. But I do think this is a good one. This is a winner. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited for this. This is a beanie for a baby that has a beard attached to it. I'm gonna try to put it on Flynn right now. It is getting close to his nap time, so I don't know if he's gonna be into this. Look at that. <laughs> what a cute boy. Look at you, Flynn. Oh, don't eat it. <laughs> Flynn, you're so cute. I don't think he likes it though, so I'm gonna take it off, but that is hysterical. Love that. That is a win.
it. Speaking of weird hats with hair, this is another hat for babies. Do you wanna try this one, Flynn? Ooh, look at you. <laughs> Chunky he looks. Why is this so cute? I am obsessed with this hat to be honest. Like, hello. <gasps> So Flynn is at an age, he's four months, he's starting to grab onto things and hold things. So this is amazing. It's a rattle, but it looks like one of those, what are those things called? People exercise with things. I don't exercise, so I couldn't tell you what it's called. It's so cute. It's kind of heavy though, and I'm afraid he's gonna like bonk his own face with it, but we're gonna try it. Ooh, big boy. Oh, he already dropped it. Too heavy for you? You're so strong. You're so strong. Oh. He's still learning how to hold things, okay? You wanna try again? You wanna try the other hand? Maybe you're right-handed and your right hand is stronger. There we go, strong book. Not too much? I think it's cute. And I think you look strong with it. Hold on. Big boy! Oh, <laughs> he does not want to hold on to that thing. I think I'll actually use this one. This one's really funny and it's super cute. So I think we'll use this one. I'm excited for this. Okay, this is too big for him, but we're still gonna try it. So it's gonna make him look like he's all tat tatted up. So we gotta try this thing out, um, even though it's a little too big. That does not look like tattoo sleeves at all. I didn't think that for a second. I mean, maybe I got a size too big, but I feel like even if I didn't, it wouldn't like look, pattern. yeah, it just looks like a weird pattern. I'm gonna flex on him. Now it looks totally real. <laughs> cool flexing. sleeves, bro. Strong boy. Flexing. Yay, strong boy. Okay, I got him a bunch of weird mustache binkies. I also have this duck bill one. So we're gonna wash these and we're gonna see how he looks with different kinds of mustaches. Okay, here's the duck one. I am super excited about this. There we go. Duck baby. <laughs> That's so funny. <laughs> That's so cute, Flynn. I like your duck. Oh my god, look at this. <laughs> Cute baby, you like that binky? That is adorable. Okay, that's a win. Let's try the mustaches. Okay, time to try mustache. <laughs> it's so funny how it like moves around as he sucks on it. Okay, hello, that is adorable. Flynn, you look like a gentleman. Okay, let's try this mustache. Oh, that's incredible. Love, that's the cutest thing I've ever seen. Approved. This one is approved. Strongly recommend. What else we got in here, Flynn? Oh my god, this is so cute. Okay, this is a teether that looks like a vintage Game Boy. This is the Game Boy that I played with as a kid because I'm an old dinosaur. Flynn, we're gonna try this, but I have to wash this um, before you put it in your mouth. Ah! I'm sorry, it has to be clean. You got your Game Boy? Ooh. Are you gonna eat your Game Boy? Yeah, eat your Game Boy. He likes it. You like it? So mommy, I'm not supposed to eat my Game Boy, I'm supposed to play my Game Boy. Good boy. What do you think? I think he likes it, y'all. I think he likes it, this one's a win. He's teething right now. It's like a week later from when I filmed all the other Amazon stuff and he's starting to teeth. So this has actually come in handy. So I'm, I'm stoked on this one. What do you think, Flynn? You like it? Okay. And the final thing I'm so excited about is this. So this thing you put on his head, you get, take a shower with him or a bath or whatever, and it keeps the water and the soap out of his eyes. Mm. So I'm really excited to try this. Okay, <laughs> Looking good, okay. buddy. <laughs> it's getting on my camera, that's for sure. So we can I think it's working. We're only washing the top of his head. Yeah. Well, so like you can take him in the shower or like pour water on their head and it won't get all on their face. I mean, it looks pretty cool. There we go. Totally works. This is not a good product. <laughs> what do you think? Ugh, so much drool, Flynn. Mmm, I love you. All right, so I need to do my outro while I'm bouncing because he's getting fussy, and if I don't bounce, he'll start to cry. Thanks for watching. Um, if you guys see any other weird baby products that you think I should test out, send them my way. Let me know because I would love to try out other stuff. Oh my gosh, he's yawning. It's time to go to do a nap. Huh, pumpkin. But I hope you guys like this video. If you did, give it a thumbs up and leave a comment. Tell me which one of the products was your favorite. I think I like the hat with the hair because he just looks so cute and silly. So I I think I like those best. But I gotta go because I gotta put this little pumpkin to sleep. Don't forget to get tickets to my tour. Right now we only have a few dates. We are looking to add more cities. So if you want me to come to your city, let me know. It's a big, fun comedy tour. It's a comedy show with me and Miranda. You don't like Miranda? Okay, I've gotta go give him a nap. I love you guys and I'll see you next time. Thanks for watching everybody. I love you and I'll see you next time. Bye.